Hi everyone, this update about Bitcoin. Bitcoin is still struggling one of my particular price target in between. So I still not yet subscribe the channel, subscribe the channel, press the like button, leave a comment guys. That's how you're motivating me and help me to achieve 2000 subscribers level. And do not forget to press the like button guys. That's how you're motivating me and help me to grow the channels. So uh, right now I'm going to talk about the Bitcoin. Everyone know which chart I opened. So pretty much you guys remember I talk about that scenario and previously I give you one of the price move how the price can move so I deleted that where I copied that full of scenario how the price move and if you did not check my previous Bitcoin video check that be, uh, previous Bitcoin videos so then you will have understand where the price is going to move. So right now still you guys remember I have one of price box 22,900 and pretty much uh, I want to highlight the price maybe you guys do not see the price targets 17,595 level that the previous bottom price so the price is, is still struggling in this inside the box because we're trying to move higher and touch the trend line and drop drastically that's what we seen before and 200 period moving uh, sorry 50 period moving average also in right now downtrend so the next fake out might be we will touch the uh, 200 period moving average and previously what happened we are trying to break the 200 period moving average we're seeing drastically drop at the moment so right now still we did not go above than the 20,482 this is the price line since long time I'm monitoring and still we did not go below than 18,881 that is the bullish scenario is still holding Bitcoin that's what I need to show you I will tell you why I'm telling the bullish scenario is still holding so inside this one still we landed exactly levels of below than the 6185 FIP level is there and again the 786 FIP level 19,219 19, levels so still we are above than that that is the best scenario right now we need to see the breakout thing happen to 20,451 we need to break that level so in case of we break that level we can consider in a bullish wave count till the time we are below than that that's going to be the disaster scenario for bitcoin so right now we're seeing some kind of relief rally after it started to drop because we did not start to move higher than my previous expectation everyone remember my previous expectation area is above this box and the trend line as well so at least we need to move above 50 percentage Fibonacci retracement everyone know what is the price target for 50 percentage Fibonacci retracement 21,388 that is this level might be you did not see sorry uh, 21,388 so right now the confusion what's happened in a stock market pretty much we follow the same scenario in a stock market and ethereum is the highest gainer today because ethereum get that confident to price to move higher but bitcoin is still only three percentage move little bit higher almost one thousand dollar increase we can see and i will show you why we stopped that particular area why we did not go higher we stopped previously the same levels i will show you where we stop in the same levels if i draw one line pretty much this is the line 20,430 and my line is 20,482 uh, 20, is pretty much very close that's why we're seeing the reaction for downside right now we need to see one engulfing candle for this entire move so then we can see the bullish scenario so previously if I've zoomed out here you guys can see several times we came that area one i'll show you the i'll mark down one in here one in here and one in here while we're starting to move higher from the downside and this three times we drop drastically guys that's what i need to show you and previously we're trying to hit here 
drop drastically to again 18,800. Again, we drop drastically for 19,266. And the previous drop again after hit this level, we dropped 19,500. So that meaning previously three times show after drop a little bit and starting to move higher, we seeing the reaction is to downside. That's what I need to mention and I need to show to my community. So right now the same scenario is pretty much clear. Similar scenario we can see here guys. That's what I need to show you. So similar scenario, we drop drastically and where I start to drop 20,100 level, better I copy that one. So one minute guys, if I copy this entire moves till down, so we can understand easily where the price is going to be. Okay, right now we can consider we seeing this peak. So we're starting from here, you guys can see. That's what I need to tell you. The previously what happened, it's only the little bit different. You guys can see the price move and how the price reaction happened and the similar scenario. Only little bit more candlesticks here because we trying to move above and trying to hold that area after that drop drastically because of the Jerome Powell uh, meeting is there that's why we will hold this much after dropped and after that one one time fake out for downside and today stock market giving the strength to move higher that is the super bullish scenario for today guys so the similar kind of move we drop drastically and move little bit higher the same levels and the next possibility might be we can see the similar kind of scenario we will going to land 18,881 dollar level is the one of possibility guys try to understand we cannot tell 100% right now we can copy that move is possible that's what I need to show you and then next we can consider along with the RSI that is going to be the super best scenario in RSI we seeing the bottom price 100% accurate and the price move higher RSI move higher right now more than my expectation area that's 38.97 we seeing the above right now we seeing downside potential if I copy that lower levels so the lower levels is the previous peak here guys so that meaning we are seeing the potential to move higher than the previous peak here so right now prices need to be bounced from here guys so the prices trying to move higher and still downside potential and the selling pressure there that's what i need to show you might be next scenario we seeing little bit higher price rsi and landed it here get the bounce that's possibility that meaning we can see little bit pull back till here after that one we trying to break that level and retest and go move higher i need to see the trend line breaking out guys because tre this trend is going to be break that is the bullish scenario beginnings the beginning for the bullish scenario we need to break that the trend line that's what i need to show you today but it's still possibility to move down right now and you guys remember pretty much my this line how the price move i draw it still there so rsi trend line did not move higher than this particular area but still price struggling the 37 the trend line we'll see the trend line reaction for that one that's we need to monitor closely guys so the right now again stochastic rsi pretty much already move more than expectation that meaning stochastic rsi need to be reset but it's still stochastic rsi can stay a little longer there it doesn't matter but star rsi support should be there and i'm always telling when we seeing the bottom levels of this <coughs> sorry in rsi this is the best buy entry and i'm always telling kindly consider the price drop rsi also the same level of peaked area so like this kind of scenario the best buy entry for short term you will have a three to five percentage 
gains so we buy from this bottom imagine guys so right now you are in a profit way you can take the profit from the nearest area when you're seeing the lower levels or well, still you want to try a little bit more higher prices right now in a four hour very close 20,866 uh, 50 period moving average that is the next scenario so you guys can monitor easily if I go to my daily chart you guys can see daily engulfing candle there because we already break the yesterday and starting to move higher and trying to achieve the day before yesterday also and that is the next bullish scenario for Bitcoin guys right now I give you one of the first resistance area we need to break that level still there is the place we can see the struggling 21,522 for a Bitcoin before then that you guys can see most of the time we get the bounce from here that 20,705 that's going to the next large wave resistance I'm waiting to see that resistance how the price reaction happening so the possibility areas I already gave so we need to monitor closely right now still Bitcoin did not show any potential to move higher and the like the huge volume or the huge candle you guys can see only the selling candles are huge but the buying candles are very small only here and here two candles almost and after that one we don't see in this area there's one more big candles but you guys can see the large of selling candles you guys can see that's what I need to show you and previously I talk about here the way of price holding below than the 21,522 I'm really not happy with that one probably price going to be land below it's happened already and right now we have one engulfing candle that is the bullish scenario we need to monitor closely might be the next candle we can see tomorrow the downside potentials today we have a relief rally that relief rally increase the prices for everything we get the support from uh, stock market that is the super bullish scenario guys if you love the content subscribe to the channel press the like button leave a comment guys thank you very much have a lovely day be safe